Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, and welcome back to Let Us Play. I'm your host, Father Evan. Oh, silly Ron Galena soundtrack. It's not Monday, it's Thursday. It just feels like an eternal Monday this week. It's been one of those weeks, but happy to be here with y'all here on uh, Let Us Play. Going to be diving back into some Spirit Fair. Uh, this game is amazing. It has me completely enraptured, uh, so I'm not going to waste any time. Let's get back into it. How y'all doing today? Okay, I think we just came to this place. Ooh, we want to talk to this guy. Uh, how do I talk to... Controls are weird. Ah, oh, Francis says, it's your lucky day. How lucky you must be. I got a new errand just for you. Fresh off the presses. Have a look-see. That's the uncle's voice. Why am I doing that voice? Uh, whatever. Doing well, sun just came out. Ooh. Oh, fresh. The the sun coming out after fresh snow is always pretty, in my opinion. I like that they tell you, by the way, that has no use, should be sold. We're rich. Rich, I tell you. Uh, oh, mystery seeds. Yes, we like those. Shoveling is no bueno. That is fair. Oh, I can claim that one. I can claim that one. Uh, I need more turnips. Okay. Ah. You find your first treasure map. Oh, you might find something interesting from it. Look inside. You'll find some coordinates for treasure. Okay, thank you. Feedorama Flyer. Dear future customer, this is Madison at Feedorama. We are currently running a promotion for our new food delivery service. Stop on by Hummingbird to hear all about it. A sales rep is waiting for you. Cheers, Madison. Does that mean I no longer have to... Uh, feed my my villagers. Negative 58, negative 52. Okay. Oh, and we got this person last time. Who, so given that they're a hedgehog... Oh, that was very nice. Thank you. I'm wondering... And the, they had the whole thing with, like, the, um, getting the sheep and the sheep don't get along. I'm wondering if this person has a story about wanting to be loved, but also not letting people in. Oh, thank you. I was getting very hungry. Uh, ooh, linen is always good. So we need linen to make cloth. Uncle Atul wants something. I don't even know where we are. I forgot. Oh, I'm so hungry. You always are. I've been asking a lot lately. I got a big appetite. It goes well with my love of food. But you know what I could go for? A bucket of fried chicken. That would bring me back. Because the best kind of food comes in buckets. Objectively true. Cooking sounds hard sometimes. In this case, it's pretty easy. I don't have chicken for you, Uncle Atul, but, uh... So where... Okay, so we did just get to this island. So I should be checking it out. It's for Ogawa. Or did we come here? I can't remember. Oh, 
Oh yeah, we also got the glide ability. Okay, we we did come here. We did everything here, never mind. Rice and leak. I don't want to leak on my boat. That sounds bad. Popcorn comes in buckets. Exactly. Uh, so we had the treasure thing. So it was negative 52 or 58, something around there. And negative 50. So let's head out to that area. Because that's actually taking us into the unknown. Which is exciting. Oh, sheep, you could do with a shearing. Here, we'll also feed you. We'll feed you coffee beans. That can't possibly go wrong. all of a sudden. I think I might be growing a bit tired. Maybe I'm not rested enough yet. I'll just take a little me time and then we can continue our lesson. I'm excited for the next step. You're making fantastic progress, honeybee. Don't give up. Uh, oh, you are very, very hungry. Um, oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. Hug. Oh, don't you feel better now? Let go a tool. Have some coffee. So yeah, there's these like nebula pill bugs. I don't know quite how to get them yet. Is that tuna? Yep, it's just tuna. Hello there. Oh, you're tired, aren't you? Oh, of course, so many children are bound to leave you exhausted. Maybe we could just play with them a bit, let you rest. What do you think, Stella? Oh, we'll have so much fun. I used to play this game with my grandchildren all the time. Just catch them and bring them back to their mommy. Okay, so we now know how to do the Celestial Pillbug game. Can I only... Oh, you can only carry one with you at a time. Interesting. Nebula fibers. I'm going to be making nebula clothes. Oh, there he is. There's the last one. Hiding way up there. Oh, Stella. Well, let's see what kind of fabric this makes.
Okay, nebula thread. And now we have nebula fabric. I don't know what we're going to use nebula fabric for, but it sure is pretty. Uh, I need aluminum to upgrade Alice's Cottage and Glass. I don't have either of those. Let's see. Uh, Uncle Atul, I also need aluminum. I also need ash, comet powder, and glass. I don't have any of those ingredients. And fire glow for the guest house. What about new things to build? Aluminum, marble, oak. Well, I can get more oak. That's easy. Um, oh, an orchard. We don't have an orchard yet. Air draft. Finally, you can go see some clouds. Okay, I'm going to start with an orchard if I can. I need to rearrange. kitchen there on top of the foundry. They'll share a fuel source, I guess. So we'll put the orchard there. Oh, I'm out of oak planks. I need to go fix that. <sighs> Meat stew. I imagine it's going to be the same with every vegetable, but it's always worth trying. <gasps> Treasure! Get out there, Stella! This must be where I was headed. Where did I meet Stu? Uh, which Stu are you talking about? In the game or in real life? You guess real life now? So are you talking about Father Stuart Wilson Smith? Or another stew. Oh, I need to go to the sawmill. Nope, it's the foundry. Oh, it's a play on first meat stew. Oi. Sorry, I missed the joke. But I met my uh, Paul's brother, Father Stu, when he was still a seminary and he was two years ahead of me. I met him on when he was a novice, actually, at a come and see weekend when I was discerning with the Paulists.
Okay, we're gonna build this air draft. What? What do you mean I can't build it up there? That seems like the perfect spot. Well, that seems perfectly safe. Oh, look! You can see our, the constellation of our friend that we sent off. Actually, that air draft makes it really easy to get into the kitchen. If I ever remember the controls of how to get into the kitchen. But there's another... Constellation just below hers, and we've only taken her through the ever door, so I wonder who that other one is. Is it Karen? Is it us? Oh, we're gonna find out. Oh, Rotida! So today is the feast of uh, St. Josephine Bakita. Uh, she was born in Sub Saharan Africa, was captured as a young girl, and forced into slavery. Um, actually, what quests do we have? He wants that, he wants that. For Gawa. Let's go see this. I think now that we have the um the ability to float, we might be able to get there. Uh but she eventually made her way to Italy where she was taken care of by some nuns and while they're given uh, her freedom. And she eventually joined the nuns, the Kenosian Sisters of uh, Charity, I think. South Point Docks. Hummingbird. Uh, but the way that she was loved and cared for was really the thing that convinced her to become Catholic, and I think that's a beautiful thing. And a reminder of, you know, our love, and a, her reminder uh, that there is still human trafficking. That is a, still a very real problem in the world. And so we do what we can to free people from their shackles with love, um, both literal and figurative shackles. I think that's where we want to go. Bottom line core. Oh, I was too late on ringing that. That might actually annoy people now. Oh, well. Um, Mystery seed. What's this? Leak. Well, I said I didn't want to leak on my boat, but here we are. Let's plant some corn. Come here, kitty. Those are cool light fixtures. I would legit like those in a deck out in real life.
Ooh, that's a good question. When press me on my first come and see weekend? I think. Hmm. That's a lot. That's a while ago now for me. That was like 12 years ago. Um. 13, maybe even. So it's hard to remember exactly. Uh, but I think just part of it was. The. Just the guys I met were. The authenticity of it. And. You know, kind of the sense that even the seminarians were like, yeah, we're we're in this process because we think this is what we want, but we're not 100% certain right now. You know, it wasn't like, uh, well, one day when we're all priests, it was like, you know. I don't know if I have room for the windmill now. I think I'm going to need another boat upgrade soon. Especially if we're going to try and take on another passenger. No, Uncle Atul, I do not want to catch the lightning. We have enough lightning in bottle. But unfortunately, he stops the boat when that happens, and uh, it won't keep moving until I talk to him, but I can't talk to him until I finish this. That's kind of the one design thing with this game that I don't like, but it's pretty small, honestly. Lightning storm. Don't be scared. Oh, catch some bolts. No. We're moving on. I'm sorry, Uncle Atul. It is fun, but we don't need it right now. Oh, this sheep regrows its wool fast. What is Kitty playing with? I forget what it's called, but the, uh, the like, spirit orb medallion thing that uh, Stella has on her belt the kitty was given one as well to wear on its collar. Or rather, took one. He kind of dove into Karen's robes and was like, haha, I'm going to take one now. <laughs> oh yeah, linen. Linen is so comfy. Especially in a hot day. Sounds like a cat. Yeah. There is a mode where you can play as the cat in two player. Like one person controls Stella and the other controls the cat. Summer. Have you seen Summer today? I didn't think she'd get up this morning. That's odd. She's usually up at first light. Something seems wrong with her house. Maybe Albert the Shipwright could help us. Oh, what's wrong? I can't see Stella's word bubble because the camera was stuck in a weird. Gets. Oh, Stella's having a bad day. Poor Stella. We are going to divert to uh, Albert's shipyard, though. We're right. We're pretty close, all things considered.
And ingots. This game also really requires some patience for some of these minigames. Like, and I actually, I like that. I think that's actually a good thing. But you know, it's not just like, like in Minecraft, I, I do like that you can just set stuff in a smelter and walk away. But this, you, you have to keep the bellows going and at the right amount. Oh, I don't. If I don't know that face, it's about that house, the green and brown one, right? Oh, have some sort of problem with it, don't you? Yeah, I could see it from a mile away. Listen, I know my job. Me and the boys, we're real professionals. And it's not often that we criticize another worker, workman's craftsmanship, but that house, oh, wow. It had to be the worst job I've ever seen. <laughs> so consider this a lesson. Don't just trust any old amateur. Always go to a professional. So tell me, what complaints does your passenger have? What should... She's sleeping? Oh, of course. Oh, that bald head of hers is very sensitive to temperature changes. Imagine how cold she must be. <gasps> oh. The dragon isn't depression. The dragon is cancer. She's bald from chemotherapy. That's why she's a snake. Not to mention her dry and scaly skin. No, no, she needs a temperature and humidity control system. Luckily, that place was so shoddily designed that there's ample cracks of wiring for electronics. <laughs> so yeah, there you go. Some plans and schematics for a nice all-in-one HVAC system. Pro quality. Call it a courtesy. After all, how can you repay your debt if your boat fail falls to pieces? Uh, oh, I need way more iron ingots to upgrade there. But I can upgrade to the massive Dauntless Dolphin. Ooh, we're actually... We're pretty close on with the linen fabric and the iron ingots. We might be able to get the icebreaker while we're here. And tired, tired too. Yeah, good, great point. Nope, not edit. Improve. Uh, glass. I need glass. Okay, I don't have glass. Oh, but we'll have this soon. The Monstro Deliciosa. Ooh, is that going to be enough iron? I'm going to have enough iron. So I'm guessing glass, I probably need to go find sand and throw it into the furnace. But we needed more linen fabric as well. Of course, we have lots of threads, so that's easy. Like sands through an hourglass. The days of our lives. Is that show still running? That's certainly enough linen fabric. You got a beautiful orchard full of apples. You do know what lives and reads inside, don't you? Is it a bookworm, Albert? Bookworms! 
<laughs> Dang it, we're still two iron ingots off. That's uh Um I only have four thousand glims. Okay, so let's go set course for somewhere where we can get iron and maybe some glass. Actually, very first thing first. While we're in this neighborhood, let's go to bottom line core. Also, I don't know what apples in the orchard he's talking about. Nothing's grown yet. Ended in 2022. Ooh. Longest running scripted show. Well, nothing lasts forever, I guess. it'll be beneficial to have rice. Oh, they're on Peacock and they're still going. Okay, never mind. It's still running. Morning, Uncle. You must be hungry. Yep. Let's give you some meat stew. Oh, I had a hankering for this. Oh, you might have noticed there was a large empty nook in my house. You know what? We should add a wardrobe. Yes, a fancy dresser. Oh, your clothes. You don't seem to have any words or your own outfits. This would be a perfect opportunity. What do you think? Okay. No, you're not that hungry. Oh, that was very nice. Thank you. Okay, so this HVAC, we just need the glass now. And where is... There's your place. Alice's Cottage. We need raw ore? Really? Now you tell me after I smelt all my ore? This is unfair. But you can see just how massive our house, our, our ship has become with that last upgrade. Oh, hey, she came ab ashore. Oh, right. I think we need glass to fix that. can't jump off that high enough. I feel like I'm missing something. Aha! 
Go away. Okay, there's a light up above that office, which tells me it's probably... Uh, tied to the electricity. Yeah, I feel like I get something that makes me jump off of bouncy stuff just a little higher. We haven't been to South Point Docks. Okay. So it seems you can't really find out what something has, what an island has, until you go there. Which is fair. Let's go to South Point Dock, because we're here. Maybe doing that will also reveal some islands to us in the distance. That's a lot more space because the the bow steps used to start right here next to Uncle Tool's room. Hello? Okay, apparently there are pointy rocks that we cannot navigate past here. So that's what that dotted line is. This one must be the ice wall. Cause, oh no, that's the ice wall. Okay, so there must be different kinds of walls. Interesting. Um, yeah, let's just go to this, this meadow, I guess. You can build a lot higher as well. Yes, I can. In fact, now we could probably do some rearranging. Oh, it's just barely too long there. Um, <laughs> Uncle Tool, I'm good. We're not... Not doing that right now, Uncle. I'm sorry. Um, what if I did something like this where I built essentially districts? So I could have the guest house.
So what I'm thinking is kind of industry on the right, housing on the left, and ag agriculture in the middle. To what end? Because I think it would be pretty and fun. I don't really have a great reason. But we're also just boating along, so I'm not in like a rush to do too much. So it's kind of like a little fun puzzle, just rearranging everything. Oh, this is a house. I need to move that over that way eventually. There we go. Oh, little one. Oh, she is hungry. Shellfish stew. Oh, this is absolutely delicious. There's nothing more reassuring than a good old-fashioned dish like this. I love it. Thank you very much. Oh, look, our trees have grown quite a bit. In fact, that one just grew up in front of our very eyes. Ooh. Everlight, that's what it's called. Ooh. That's the light, the bobble that Stella and the cat have, which... Daffodil, that's the cat's name, Daffodil. Don't really have a lot that I want to make there. Let's up some maple logs. This game is just gorgeous. Like, look at these clouds. Look at this sunset. These hues. Oh, we're going right through the Everdoor, basically.
We need a, a desk for Uncle Atul. He wants fried chicken. She wants the wardrobe. We need to restore the power to speak to that CEO. We need glass for summer. Come on, let me go to sleep. It's sleepy time. There we go. She has stars on her blanket. Yes, she does. Well, remember, the name Stella means star. Sometimes used in conjunction with Mary as uh, Stella Marie, star of the, the, the sea. And stars are her guide, especially for sailors, this is true. And her hat's a star. Okay, so the apple tree has grown. Doesn't have apples yet, but that's okay. Oh, I did not ring the bell. I need to ring the bell. Please don't get mad at me. I'm sorry I ring the bell late. Did you know Atul loves pork chops? Yeah, Atul just loves food. Wrong vertical building. I guess she's stuck in bed until uh, we get that HVAC system built. We're so close to our destination. You wonder if a tool died of coronary disease. It's possible. We'll find out, I suppose. Should be coming up on this new island. There it is. You always have those pillars of light kind of around an island. Resuteno Meadows. I can just shear wild sheep. Nice. I could theoretically feed it and bring it back. It is a very pretty mountain. Oh, look at all these trees. I'll be picking up some wood. Hoping to do some work on this later. So by you picking up wood, you mean me picking up wood.
Is the tool unhappy now because he's hungry? Yes. Have a pool of eggs. Ooh, wait, this is a rock I can meditate at. Hmm. When the others aren't looking, I like to lick the rock. It helps me concentrate. It's also a bit salty. Hmm. Oh wow, I've heard of rock I've heard of this rock from a friend. He said that if you stand next to it for like a week, you can become a seagull or something. Hmm. I don't get it. I've been here for days. Everyone says that they feel something. I don't feel anything. What gives? I should have quit my job. Oh, brother. <laughs> hey, licking rocks is a very important way to help identify them, according to geologists. Not shared rocks. Salt is a shared rock. There's not a lot on this, but I can't seem to... I don't have a prompt or anything to meditate, so... I guess I'll have to come back. Maybe I, after I get some more lessons. I keep my salt to myself. A salt cellar. Which is different from a salt cellar. Someone who sells salt. Oh, interesting. Crows and Dink, I can't get there. So it's grayed out because of whatever wall this is. Okay, let's go to Hakashima Lighthouse. Ooh, yes, rice. And... Sure, we'll do shrimp. Those are big trees. So, if, given how tall this is and the fact that there's still more expansions to buy, this makes sense just as a get-around-your-own-boat tool. Oh, pretty. Look at that little lighthouse. Hikarashima. Yes, Stella, I baked something for the crew. I'll let you distribute it. You only gave me one. And I can't give it to... A tool's not hungry for once. Where is he? My stomach isn't rumbling. Yet. Yeah, I can't give it to him. And I can't give it to um, our snake friend because she's vegetarian. Can buy some pork, pea seed, lettuce seed, linen seed. Wow, cherry seeds are expensive. And opal. Hmm. Ooh. 
I like getting some sun here. It's peaceful. Sometimes it isn't. Especially when people love to jump on this umbrella. They jump up and down, up and down. They love to bounce on the thing. It drives me out of my skin. <sighs> Nothing else I can do but complain, I suppose. Stop that! What are you doing? You're ruining this very pleasant day. Stop that bouncing right this instant. You can't just come here and bounce like the, some kind of overexcited youth. You're stressing me out. You need to calm it down. Here's some free advice. You'll never be able to get up there. I've seen people with better legs than you try. Fine. If you really want to, you'll need two things. First, a good attitude. That just applies to life in general. Everything is an attitude. Then you need to visualize bouncing higher. Or, I don't know, learn a new skill. I'm sure you'll figure something out. You'll learn how to bounce someday. A calm and cool attitude and more leg power. Now stop it. I'm just a simple person who doesn't like it when people jump on my umbrella. Hey, they confirmed for us what I had uh, figured out already. That we get something to help us jump higher at some point. Being a skill. But it ain't here. Okay. Tuna, Hoseki Quarry, Shrine. Got the spirit from there. Iron. This has more resources that we have yet to discover. I wonder if... I'm going to go back there, because if nothing else, we do need more iron for various things, because we need it for the, uh, the snow... or for the ice plow and the... Wait, where do you think you're going? No, get back here! Dang it. Ah. You got away from me. Uh, we need it for the wardrobe, we need it for the AC system, and we need it for the... Uh, something else. Southern Oil! Okay. Oh, you are very hungry, my friend. Have some corn. Oh, I don't have anything left to plant in those. But I can make this for our friend. There we go. Now she has a great big old plant. Because we've basically exhausted every island in the starting area. Which leads me to believe that we'll find glass and aluminum in the next. Meaning we have to get the icebreaker.
can't quite get up there yet. Iron ore, good, good. There's a very small crack right there. Why do I feel like that's going to be... <gasps> wait. Wait. Last time we were here, we didn't have... Flying with the hat. Ooh, a field upgrade. Which one's the field? Is that where... It's not where I keep my sheep, is it? This will most definitely be enough iron to complete all the projects we currently have and need it for. Which is good. Do I have unlimited carrying? Yes. My pockets are infinite. It's all in the hat. And the hat's quite big, so... I want infinite pockets too. Sorry, people! That was the wrong button! Sorry, I overshot. I was trying to go to sleep. I'm sorry for waking you all. <laughs> Reunited with a hat. A tale as old as time. Uh, okay, so it's... Okay, so that's the field. So we need bright jelly. I don't have any, but I know where to get that, at least. Uh, see your cereal grow faster. Okay, I like that. Oh, hey, look, we have apples. Um, that doesn't even have improvements. We can't do anything with it. Uh, where, where's her? There it is. We can build her wardrobe. Don't think you can carry much in your hat. Definitely can't fly. It's fair. Oh, wondrous. You're spoiling me, Stella. What an incredible piece of furniture. It livens the room so much. Just so much cozier now. And filled to the brim with clothes and accessories, too. Oh, you don't know how happy that makes me. Well, what are you waiting for? Jump out of these old you know, clothes. Pick up something jazz to it. Oh, okay. So you can customize if you desire. Oh, nope, like the green hat. I mean, honestly, just... The way Stella is already, I I dig. I don't see a need to change it. 
strain salad. Okay, let's set a course really quickly. Oh, this is a spirit we haven't adopted yet. I wonder. Let's go. Actually, before we go there, let's set. We're going to set sail so we can go through that uh, glimmer jellyfish thing. That salad would be good for my vegetarian friend. Unfortunately, I can't. She can't eat anything until she gets out of bed. Man, I wish harvesting fruit from a tree was that easy. Just go up to it. Oh. I hear you, Uncle Atul. I do not see you. Are you in your house? No. Fish curry? I don't know if I've ever had fish curry. Oh, some people are getting a bit hungry. Have you thought about the next meal? Oh my goodness. Yes, I'm trying to find Uncle Atul because I get that he's hungry. There he is. Oh, he made some planks for us. And he's running away! Uh, Fisherman's Pie. That's what we needed to give him. Oh, we got some more seeds that we can use up in our field. That's nice. So I think it was the coffee that made the uh, sheep's wool go grow back so quickly. Which, if true, I think is very funny. Quartz Dragon. The fact that that's called a Quartz Dragon makes me wonder if there are other... Kalstein Mines. I feel like I could get aluminum there. Um, but the fact that it's referred to as Quartz Dragon there makes me wonder if there are other dragons available.
No. We're on a quest right now, Uncle. I'm sorry. As soon as we're through getting jellyfish, bright jellies will be good. Cause we need. I forget what it was to upgrade, but uh, there was definitely something that needed it. That's cool, you can set a way... I did not know that until just now, but you can set a waypoint and it will show you what the trajectory will look like and what you'll pass through. So if you're like, ah, uh, no, I really want to avoid something, it gives you that option. The joys of home ownership, there's always something to upgrade and fix. Yep. And in this case, I'm growing most of that, I guess. Oh, so that's how you start an event with someone who's no longer on your ship. That's clever. Because she's the one who'd always activate it for us. Man, that, uh, that other one was zooming past. We're mostly after the green ones because they have the special. How, uh, the thing on her, the sigil on her door that looked like her constellation was glowing. So that's why you need to keep the apartment of someone who's no longer on the ship around. Because, like, Uncle Atul is the one who always triggers the, um... Uh... Words. The the lightning one. The lightning minigame. So when he's taken through the Everdoor, we'll use his apartment to still activate it. Some of these green ones are just going by so fast. It's hard to tell at a distance if it's a fast or a slow one until it's basically too late. Still, we got we got enough. We only needed like two. But yeah, you see the the horns on the her door, which interestingly enough are also right here on the. Uh, on the loom. On the fabric shot. So that's on a call tool symbol, I guess, is that, like, star, and then... Yeah, we've got this flower, her pearl necklace, these flowers. Hey, Brit, How you doing? since we need to make some iron ore. Let's do that while we're making this last part of the voyage. Doing alright. Got to interview an old couple about their marriage for work thing and putting in 200 address labels on magazines. 
Not always the most thrilling work, but... You know, honestly, there's a time and a place when I do, like, just having a rhythmic task like that that I can do. But the interview sounds really cool. There you go. Chance to hang out and chat. Wow, 64 years. God bless them. So there's a spirit on this island that we can talk to and potentially See if they want to come and join us. And some other resources while we're at it. It's going down. It's yelling timber. I'll be the one that you remember? Yeah, 64 years of marriage just points to a uh, good longevity in general. Okay, so there is a... The thing is telling me there's a spirit here, but... Maybe we can't see them yet? Curious. So let's set sail for the shipwright. So I think if I can get the uh, icebreaker, I think that'll help. The sheep always looks so terrified when I come to shear it. It's like, oh, don't worry. I know what I'm doing. I think. No. I mean, fair, but these are magic shears made of the Everlight. Does that make it worse? It's too dark to navigate. Well, okay, but let me finish smelting. Smelting? Smelting. Sure. What was she in that tea I had? I think it's the chamomile. It's making me sleepy. Sleepy eepy, as they, as my VTuber friends say. Also, I did not have befriending uh, three VTubers 
on on my uh, 2024 bingo card, but uh, I'm here for it. But I haven't hugged you lately, so you get a hug. Oh, wasn't that big. A nice favor for my favorite niece. Oh, little one. We should probably eat soon. People get restless. I'm definitely getting... Well, we know she's a grandma. She's mentioned her grandchildren. Oh, I... No, I don't know. It seems so exotic. So different from what I know. I don't think I can eat that. What? What is that exotic? Uh, we've already given her meat stew. Where did I give her shellfish stew? Oh, another incredible old-fashioned dish. Thank you for your kindness, Stella. Oh, we need to hug her. Aw, I like that Stella gets down on her knees to hug her because of the height difference. Eaty. No, I'm actually trying to leave. All right, back at the ship, right? I thought he was just going to try and let me use his shop. He did a terrible pun. I don't even need to do father puns. He does them for me. But anyway, yeah, we can make the icebreaker. Then there's Hermes Him. Go faster. Nice. Okay, Rock Destroyer. That gets through the rocks we're looking at. Coral Breaker. So go faster again. Mist Cleaner. So miss. Go faster again. Faster again. Okay, cool. So there's songs that make you go faster, and there's different prows. Oh, that's an ugly prow, but it does what it needs to, I guess. How does that actually look when I'm sailing? Uh, yeah, this is the main island we can see on the other side of the ice... Ice wall. A lot of prowess. Okay, that doesn't look so bad. Not much I can do about it anyway. It's there now, so... Hmm, corn. Theoretically, if I can grow, if I can learn to grow wheat, I can make uh, apple pie. Is there anything interesting along this path other than the fact that a tool is going to want to do that? No. In fact, that's all there is on the path. How about an apple pan dowdy? Is this a pun or is this an actual thing? Because if it's a pun, I don't get it. If it's a food, I don't know it. <laughs> yes, we would need the bright jellies to upgrade our field.
More nebula fabric, bright jellies. Oh, we can actually almost do that. We don't have the jellies, but we can get the jellies. And I think we can make the fabric, because I don't think I've ma used up all the thread. Yeah, I still have some nebula thread. Apples cooked in brown sugar with a pastry crust broken into sugar-coated pieces. It's a real recipe. Okay, that sounds delicious. I don't think the game will have that, but I could be wrong. So we need her HVAC. We need glass for that. Aluminium glass. I know that. We don't have that. Don't have fire glow. Aluminium. Don't have it. Don't have comet powder or ash. So that'll be something to look for. So yeah, if we can just get some bright jellies, we can upgrade the foundry, which would be nice. Maybe it'll make more, uh, in fact, let's go this way so we can go and get some bright jellies. since it's not terribly out of our way. So when we get there, um... Oh, it's so cute. Um... This door should start glowing. I'm so terrible with names, though. I can't remember her name. Ah. Aha, see? See how it's glowing? Okay, mostly caring about the green ones. Okay, we need four more and we can upgrade the foundry. Two more. We just need to hit one more void glim. It's not going to be that one. Could be this one, though. Yeah. Now, of course, the more we catch, the better. Look at the size of that one.
All right. That actually uses up a good amount of the lightning in a bottle, too. So let's see how much more this allows us. Okay, it's still the same amount. Maybe the output is more? Up oh, there goes the ice wall. I do think the meter's also moving faster. Oh yeah, that made twice as many ingots. That is pretty sweet. eaten today. You're full. And you're still stuck in bed. I don't want to find out by experimenting, but what happens if all your spirits are angry with you all the time? Like, you don't feed them, you don't pay attention to them, you don't give them housing. Like, do they just leave, you think? Do you have to go back to where they were and be like, Hey, I'm sorry, let's try again. I don't know. And like I said, I don't really want to find out by experimenting, because I like keeping my spirits happy. They probably leave. You're probably right, but then does that mean they're just gone from the game forever? That seems unlikely because then you can't do some of the events to get uh, the materials. So you must be able to get them back after that. but they're probably going to be annoyed with you. All right, what's this new island? Kalstein Mines. Well, maybe if we can get some aluminum here, that'll be something at least. Ooh, everything's frozen. Hmm. Oh, wait one second there. You can't be here. This mine has been abandoned for 40 years. You can't just waltz in there. You don't have the proper credentials. But I love the attitude. I do see some potential in you as a future security recruit. You just need some training. I went to school for this job, you know. I suppose if you went out and got said training, I would deputize you. That could work, actually. A yeah, break once in a while does sound nice. Listen, go out there and train for this job. Double jump, glide, zip line around. Okay, we have... Two of those. You need to be able to do all that before you, you, I can make you part of the team. I'll see you around, future recruit. No! I cannot go in! Rude! Mood goes down, but that's it. Huh. And that is punishment in and of itself. Ooh. Funny onion man. Let's go shopping.
No! We just barely didn't make it there. I hope he doesn't move too much in the night. Okay, he's still there. I was, I was worried during the night he might sail off in another direction. Let's sell our tchotchke. Oh, when did we get another amethyst? Um, does not have a lot. What about errands? Pears? I don't have pears. Let's go check out some crates, because they're here. Ooh, it's all snowy. Makes sense that after you pierce through the uh, ice wall, it gets cold. Oh, check out the ice plow. It takes on all the ice. This has got to be cold water. Aluminum. Sorry, aluminium. I'll plant those seeds in a moment. I want to set course for somewhere else first. That's all ice wall, ice wall, ice wall. Well, nothing ventured, nothing gained. <laughs> like how the cat floats. Yeah, it's very cute and it is very cat. I almost wish I had bought this on Switch so that I could play it, uh, you know, like comfortably in bed on my own when I'm done with it on stream. But I think I'm actually thankful that I didn't do it precisely for that reason, because I could see myself just getting sucked into this game for hours. Okay, 
Okay, let's take a look at the map as we're going along, because we might see something. New Island, yeah, I can't get to it because of the mist wall. Wondering if I'm going to find glass in these crates. And if that's where I need to go, or if it's... Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Of course, I'm also looking at the time, and not a lot of time left in the stream today. So I'll probably just stay up here in the ice wall area. This one, because it has the dot next to it, that's where there still is a spirit. Do you still dream of being a sailor? Yeah, basically. Honestly, yeah, I know. If I could be, you know, just like a sailor in the Caribbean on a, you know, maybe like a 30-foot vessel. Or a crew member on a tall mast. I think that would be, you know, I do recognize that I'm romanticizing it and fantasizing it, but you know what? It sounds nice. Also, how you doing, Gail? Well, it's crates, so we might find some sort of resource there that's helpful. You know, there are some mildly uncomfortable indications about the shipwrecks in this game. Work sucks, but you just had a nice cappuccino. There you go. The only place where it's appropriately dry is that from your own machine. Also, what makes a cappuccino dry? Like, when I think of dry in liquids, I think of, like, wines. Air content in the foam. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Boom. We got your desk, Uncle Atul. Okay, let's set sail again. Right there. Yeah, that makes sense. I just don't do the cappuccino thing, so... I don't do the coffee thing. Uh, that's how I want to talk to you. You want your fried chicken, but I did your... I upgraded your house. There's a lot of danger of scalding the milk if you steam it too heavily. That's... that makes sense. Hey! We found something! Loneberg. And that was interesting, because it was actually farther away. 
I'm not so feeling hot so right now. I've got a lot on my mind. I keep thinking about my friend Zazzy. Did you ever meet her? We used to organize rallies when we were younger. This picture of me and her is the only picture I have left in my wallet. I've had it for 40 years. Your Aunt Viv would murder me if she knew I didn't have at least one picture of our kids. Yeah, and she adored Zaz. Everyone did. Maybe we should hang it in my house. I won't get rid of the folds, but at least still, I won't get water all over it. But you may have noticed that normally when we discover something, but we can see it already on the map, it's it's very close when it does that cutscene. In this case, it was actually quite distant. I like that little touch. I had been curious about that. Okay, what do you... Oh, that's the sawmill. Glass. Comet powder. Ash. I don't have any of those. So where do you get your... Uh, Nice cappuccino. Also, I, it's a bit bold of a statement to say it's the only place in the States. There are a lot of places to get a cappuccino in the States. Oh, hey. What do you have for sale? You know what? I could actually use some of these. <gasps> Glass! Metal rope. That's interesting. Uh, I'm going to buy that while I, it's here. But the glass is huge. cafe next to your work. Only place in Utah you found. That's fair. That's more fair. Uh, I don't need to sell anything because I have pretty good money. What is going on with that sign? Oh, hey, it's a spirit we can pick up. I'm waiting for someone. Don't bother me. I think you're going to be waiting for a while. Okay, so we can zip line on that when we get that ability. Hey, welcome back, Brit. We discovered a new place and we finally found some glass for sale. I don't know how to make it. Because I assume you can make it. But, I can finally make the AC unit and make our friend feel better. And her house is fully improved, so she might be ready to go to the, um... Uh, Everdoor soon. I'm not going to make that yet because I want to hang on to the glass for that. I don't have the ash. Ooh. Another island. With another shop. Oh, still fuzzy. Oh, still... I might have overslept a bit. How long have I been sleeping? What? How much? Hibernating, you say? Actually, it's called brumating when uh, reptiles do it, but uh, anyway. Well, I guess it was bound to happen. I might have been ignoring what my body was trying to tell me. A bad habit of mine. Thank you, Stella, for taking such good care of me. You're welcome, but also have some food, finally. So that hedgehog mom will... Oh, Stella, is anything better on this than a bowl of grain salad? It's by far my favorite. Oh, this filled me up with unbridled joy. Oh, thank you so much, dear. Don't you feel better now? Don't you feel better now? Well, we have her favorite food, so that's cool. Oh, sorry about that, Brit. Oh, what, what did your message say? Oh, it was way too long for chat. That's why... Sorry. I'm still training Moobot even after, you know, a year and a half of working with him. Uh, so I'll read this out for you. Funny proposal story that I mentioned. They were at Midnight Mass together right after communion. He put the ring on her finger and he said he doesn't remember if he asked her or just put it on her hand. 
She was so embarrassed that she she put a glove on her hand. Remember, this was six, six years ago. They were both laughing really hard and telling me it's funny to think about watching that happen. That's funny. Oh no no no! You didn't you didn't do anything wrong, Brett. It's it's my auto mod. I'm still training it to. I'm still figuring out how to manage it where it is helpful and you know helps the community without also, you know, being over accidentally overbearing. Well, it's it's not really an AI in that sense. It's more just a program with rules, and I just have to modify what's allowed and what's not allowed. Uh, I would define an AI that's capable of learning a little bit differently, but yeah. This is really more just an over-glorified set of if-then if then statements. Like, it doesn't learn from... Like, I can't chastise it and be like, you know, that's not right. You should let that one through. It's a... It's basically just a gate. Like, it is way more uh, unintelligent than uh, anything like a uh, jet GPT, which is not even that intelligent to begin with. Oh, wake up, everyone. Wake up, and I'm going ashore. Okay, what do you have for sale? The Autumn End. Uh, I need that. I need that as an ingredient for the thing. <gasps> chicken! We need that for Uncle O'Toole's fried chicken. Oh, sunflower seeds. <gasps> pear seeds. I'm gonna buy a pear seed. Uh, where are my gems? I don't have room for the pear tree, but the seed is nice to hang on to, as well as, um... Having access to, uh... Do -do -do popcorn. They were also both so, so Catholic, and it was wholesome. Especially coming from a family that has a lot of non-Catholic spoken marriages made you smile. Aww. Ooh. I don't have the coins. So in order to get that, I need to entice two spirits to join me. Because they'll each give me the coin. As the wage for their fairy. But that'll get me the zipline ability. So that'll be cool. That's all growing. Yeah, I don't have a third tree spot. So this needs to get improved, but I probably need the blueprint to do that. Um, what all did I even just pick up? My brain just blinked on it. A lemon! It's made of plastic. Oh, right. Uncle Atul's chicken, so... How do I... Oh, we can upgrade to Hermes Hymn now. We have all the materials for that. As well as Expert, but I think first would probably be that. 
Uh, zip line. Again. Still, I. I wanted the dream cell. They're back. So much stronger than I ever thought they could be. These visions. I see them now as I am awake. The reefs have turned into wheat, wafts of ethyl sainted smoke. And the rotten fruit formed into the eye of the dragon, vitreous and sickly. A coil of arduous rust. Another dragon has woken. He scares me, but the suffering cannot be allowed. You would agree, I'm certain. Let's go help it, shall we? More proof that the dragons are, uh. Cancer. As to the theory that I posed earlier. Equihotic. Yeah, this game has been great. This is my fourth time playing it. Or, or fourth episode of playing it, my first playthrough. And I love the controls, the visuals, the story. Just kind of everything about it. I'm glad you enjoyed the interview, Kit. Or, or Brit. Um, I wanted to do one last thing. Your wife and I had a lot of... Yeah, player two can be the cat. I saw that and it's like, ah, oh, I wish I had a player two, but oh well. Ooh, let's plant some sunflowers. I'm afraid of screwing up the fried chicken and losing out on all the chicken I just bought. Do I need something other than just chicken to go in to... Quijada could probably answer this, actually. D uh, the recipe for fried chicken. Like, Uncle Atul gave it to me, but I can't... I don't know where to access it? I think it was just like, oh yeah, do the thing. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Recipes. I'm a genius. Fried chicken. Chicken and a fat. Do I have a fat? I don't think so. So I need to get oil. Hmm. Well, I think that's actually where we're going to call it for the day. Just looking at the time. Your wife and you just finished take two. Uh, well, a relatively fun game with a good overall message. Some of the specific story details were questionable. Hmm, fair enough. Not everything's perfect. So... But thank you so much to everyone for tuning in to Let Us Play. I've been your host, Father Evan. Uh, hope you all have a great rest of your day too, Brit. Uh, ever, hope everyone has a wonderful weekend. Uh, I myself have tickets, well, ticket to go see a show I'm very excited about. It's called White Rose the Musical. It sounded like an odd choice for something to be about a musical, but uh, I've heard good things, so I'm excited. Um, but yeah, I hope everyone has a great rest of their weekend. Join us next week uh, with more Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories on RPG Monday at 2 p.m. Uh, Eastern Standard Time. Uh, Retro Tuesday, more uh, Nerf Arena Blast. Going to finish that up. And then Thursday, more Spirit Fair. Uh, so I hope everyone has a great rest of their day. Thank you to everyone who's followed, liked, subscribed, uh, joined over on YouTube, joined the Discord, all that good jazz. So I hope you all have a great rest of your day. Let's see if we can raid someone. Nope, no one I follow is really alive right now. So, all right. Well, I hope you all have a great rest of your day. Take care and God bless.